She won two titles, Tom, on the PWBA Tour and some of her fellow bowlers, great champions, including Chris's wife, Linda there, rooting her on. Well, the key for Kendra is this nice, smooth tempo, and this one's perfect. She grabs a handful. This ball makes it back from the same spot the last one went by and just shreds the rack. Started working in pro shops as a youngster out of high school. Did Kendra. Absolutely passionate about the sport. The way that ball hit the pocket, Chris, could have been a lot worse. Yeah, earlier in the game, Kendra actually went wide and, and everything came out for 5-7. But you see this ball double dribble again. It pushes too far down the lane. Ball gets light. Headpin comes back and cleans up some of the mess, though. Leaves another 2-8, which she made earlier. Always have to be careful on the double wood. Now to chop a pin and leave it open. Nicely covered, perfect shot with her spare ball, right on the money for a second time, but she knows spares may not be enough here as Kendra's caught fire. Looks for a four bagger. 12 pin lead, Kendra gains. Works in the bowling industry as well in Orlando. She was on the tour six years, and as Tom said, so disappointed when things shut down back in 2003. This is her chance back on center stage on ESPN2. Oh, Way light. Watch it. One, two, eight left up. What happened, Chris? This here is just fast feet. Ball's early. She didn't get a chance to get a handful. The rotation is way down from the shot before. The last shot came in and hooked here. This one's going to go by and end up there. Wow. Whiff the head pin. She's a professional. She'll rebound from that shot. It, you know, her tendency on a shot like that is for her to get fast feet. Her keys are tempo, smoother, and slower. This one will be smoother and slower, and it'll get a crossed over to make the spare. Get them all. Which she does exactly, Chris Barnes. However, opens the door a bit here for Kim Terrell, heading into her seventh frame. As the match gets even closer on the spare from Kendra. Nine-pin deficit. Works on a spare. In her seventh, we may have a very dramatic finish right down to the last shot. Responds perfectly. No way. Any female bowler of this stature, legend of the game, Kim Terrell is. It's close from Vegas. Here the fabulous fashion show mall of the Las Vegas Strip. Leanne Barrett, Kara Honeychurch, Carolyn Doran Ballard are throw ready to the championship show. One of these two may get there. Kendra Gaines from Orlando, Florida. Kim Terrell from near San Francisco, head to head. And it's very close. Kendra eight frame works on a spare. Nine pin difference. <laughs> no problem. It went Brooklyn all right, didn't like it. Chris at all from the release and a five pin for her. Yeah, we've said this before. Out of the commercial break is really the toughest shot. And this shot is way left off her hand. Uh, you know, at this point, she's begging for a break. Takes care of the five pin there. Eighth frame, Kim Terrell, tight match, looks a little high, 4-7, take care of each other late, how about that shot from Kim Terrell, huge break late in the match, that could be the difference maker, 
Boy, this has been unbelievable. We haven't seen this at all. It's been totally, it's impossible to get pins to fall over. The seven almost falls back. It ends up moving back forward, topples into the four. What a great break to put her up this late in the match. By two pins, heading into the ninth foundation frame for each. Yeah, she'll take it. like it on the release, and that's why through the nose, a high shot for Kendra Gaines. And she leaves the 3-6. Back end of the oil pattern here, not a good ball reaction. Well, that's exactly what we were saying there. She's trying to get softer. It's a tough combination, though, especially with all the pressure. Hard way. Oh, oh, look out. Boy. Six pin stands, late open, devastating. For Kendra Gaines. Time after time in this competition, we've seen this. Late spares missed have cost people winning matches. Uh, somebody once told me, you know, being a great spare shooter won't win you titles, but not being one will never give you a chance. Kendra is a great spare shooter, but this is a really bad time to make a mental error. Huge miss. And Kim Terrell, co-coach for the World Junior Team, Team USA. They're very good friends here head-to-head. -head. USBC Women's Challenge. A chance to put this one away. Takes advantage of the late tap on number seven. Down it goes. And she is firmly in command. Nail in the coffin right there. She's moved left a little bit. She's getting it to the right. Watch all the pins over here. They mix around. That's been the, the key to success so far, that people have been able to throw pins over to the left and get them to hit each other have won the matches. Turkey, late finish for Kim Terrell, important. And Kendra's lost her look entirely. That's light hit. And that clinches it for Kim Terrell. She will advance on to the next round with a chance for the championship show and $25,000. The gate great Kim Terrell comes through at the right time late in the match, Critch, when you need it so badly. Yeah, she threw some great shots. Kendra had gotten herself into a position where she's had one of the toughest combinations of trying to stay soft and slow with your speed and still catch it at the bottom. It's something that all bowlers at all levels struggle with. And uh, she was able to throw three great ones there in the middle of the game, uh, but it got away from her there at the end. Kendra in Orlando, heavily involved in coaching as we talked about. Really wanted to continue her career path in bowling. Really likes the coaching aspect. And for a while was running a series of pro shops. And the business grew very quickly to three pro shops. And then it sort of, as she told us, consumed her life a bit. She's still in the bowling industry, still practices, still coaches, but she sold the pro shops, and that has allowed her to concentrate on her game and coaching a lot more. Well, she is extremely knowledgeable, and she has a love for the game, and coaching is a great fit for her. Uh, you know, she has an immense amount of knowledge, and she has a great way of communicating it. Uh, she's helping. She's helped so many bowlers up in that area, along with Junior Team USA. Is all 10 into the pit, her best shot of the day. Every shot matters, Kim. She's already clinched the match, looking good here. She rolls toward the next round. This is the Kim we all know and love. Smooth, strong, powerful, like butter. She's back on center stage here in Vegas and finishes off with a great game. 235-188 victory over Kendra Gaines, her co-coach for the Junior Team USA.